Welcome to the Monday, April 29th, 2013 edition of Erner Berry's Daily Video, sponsored by Absano's Market Insight Report. In today's video, the U.S. red meat industry's income ticked up in 2012. And later, we take a look at our HRI Movers of the Week. Now, let's look at the markets with your host, Russ Barton. Erner Berry's 2013 Executive Conference and Marketing Seminar commenced yesterday evening at Caesars Palace in Las Vegas, where nearly 400 egg and poultry executives have arrived to participate in the two-day event. Erner Berry's staff was on hand last night to greet conference attendees at the welcome reception held at Pure Nightclub in Caesars Palace, where industry executives from around the country had the opportunity to meet and greet with colleagues in preparation for two full days of center of the plate protein related industry discussions focused around this year's conference theme of managing today's opportunities, turning potential to profit. Today, the conference will open with general sessions featuring the 2013 conference's guest speakers, former NBA player Mr. Accountability Walter Bond, and CEO of Comeback America Initiative David Walker. Attendees will then head over to Dragon Ridge Country Club to participate in the annual golf out outing. The day will conclude with a cocktail party and the awards dinner where Erna Barry will name our 2013 Egg and Poultry Persons of the Year. To learn about tonight's big winners and for our day two recap, tune in tomorrow. And for up to the minute conference news updates, search hash UBExec 2013 on Twitter and follow us at Erner Barry. In other news, animal meat marketings and gross incomes ticked up in 2012. Here is Erner Barry staff writer Michael Ramsing with the latest. Cash receipts and gross income for U.S. cattle, calves, hogs, and pigs all increased in 2012. According to the USDA's Meat Animals Production, Disposition, and Income 2012 summary, total cash receipts for marketings of meat animals increased 6% from $84.7 billion to $91.1 billion. The cattle and calf industry led the rise in 2012 marketings, with cash receipts rising 8% to $67.9 billion, or 75% of all U.S. meat animal marketings. Meanwhile, hogs and pigs marketings totaled 22.2 billion pounds, a 2% rise from 2011 levels. This accounted for 25% of the total anim meat animal marketings in 2012. The industry's gross income in 2012 was $90.7 billion, a 6% increase from year-ago levels. Cattle and calves' gross incomes were up 8%, while hogs and pigs' incomes was up 2% compared to 2011 figures. For, for more information on the U.S. red meat market, be sure to click Supply Data under the Red Meat tab in Comtel. Thanks, Michael. Now we'll take a look at Erna Berry's HRI Buyer's Guide, a weekly publication dedicated to current commodity prices being paid to wholesalers and purveyors by hotels, restaurants, and institutions. We kick off last week's report with the chicken market. Boneless, skinless chicken breasts are very well supported at the moment under considerably tight supply lines and good seasonal demand. As a result, the quotations for these items have improved by just over 7% in the last week alone. Turning to pork, hams continued on their linear path of growth last week, with bone-ins gaining nearly a dollar a day for 15 days straight, thanks to interest both domestically and abroad. Boneless hams followed suit, gaining 5.88% by week's end. Moving over to our first item in the red last week, top butts have seen mostly steady spring season trading levels, finding only slightly lower levels over the past week. That said, as last week progressed, the top butt has seen some advancement in value as weather forecasts are now showing improvements. Our last item on last week's HRI report resides in the turkey market. Less than seasonable requirements for wing meat have resulted in additional whole wings flooding a disinterested market. Lower prices have attracted considerable ex export interest and a steadier scenario is developing. To see the entire HRI report, head over to Comtel and click Library under the Red Meat, Poultry, Seafood, and Egg tabs. That concludes today's video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. Today's video is sponsored by Upsano's Market Insight for the Meat Industry, providing information, education, and insight for the beef, pork, and poultry industries. View a sample report at Upsano.com or call 800-932-0617 to get your free sample today.